Good morning, Grid One. Today we will take uh, a quick revise. Uh, let's start. At first, we talk about Earth and Sun. And we said, Sun is a star. Sun is a star that give us heat and light. Okay, why Sun give us heat? We need heat to feel warm. And we need the light of the Sun to see. So, Sun gives us heat and light. Heat to feel warm and light to see. After that, we talked about Earth. And we said, Earth is a planet. And this term, we didn't talk about plants. We talk about planets. We live on planet Earth. Earth is very big and have two areas. The area of water and the area of land. The blue area is area of water. And the green area is area of land. In which area we live? People live on land. And what about the blue area? The blue area is area of water, uh, where fishes and sharks live in water. So can we live in water? Of course not. People live on land. Okay, which area is bigger? The area of water, the green is a blue area, or the green area, the area of land. Of course, the bigger area of earth is the area of water. Okay, let's answer it together. At first, we said Earth is a star. No, stars give us heat and light. Okay, Earth is a planet. Yes, Earth is a planet where we can live. Earth is a people. No, we are people. Okay, number two, people live on land or water or sun. Can people live on sun? Oh no, we will burn because sun gives us heat and light. So no, we can't live on sun. People live in water? No, we can't breathe under water. So no. People live on land? Yes, we live on land. Okay, number three, most parts. Most parts of earth are covered with what? What's the meaning of most? Most mean the bigger area. Which area is bigger? The blue area or the green area? The area of water or the area of land? Of course, we said the bigger area of Earth is the blue area. So which area is bigger? Land, people or water? Of course, what? Water. Number four, we live on sun or earth or water. We said people live, of course, on earth. Can people live on sun? No, sun is a story that gives us heat and light. We can't live on the sun, so we live on earth, planet earth. Don't forget, sun is a story, earth is a planet. Okay, after that, the sun is a story, planet or people? No, sun is a star that gives us heat and light. Okay. Number six, the space gives us heat and light. Which one gives us heat and light? Stars give us heat and light. So, sun is a star that gives us heat and light. Okay, after that. Seven, the sun gives us space to see. Oh, focus. The sun gives us heat and light. Which things help us to see? Oh, dark help us to see? Of course not. We need heat to see? No, heat help us to feel warm. What about light? Yes, we need light from the sun to see. So, sun gives us light to see. Number eight. When the sun shines, it's... Oh, do you remember sunshine and sunset? We said sunshine at the daytime and it's light but when sun sets we're going to sleep because it's dark so when sunshine it's a light sunset it's a dark okay when the sunshine it's a daytime or nighttime or dark time 
Oh, night and dark, it's the same meaning. And sunshine, of course, at the daytime. Sunshine can't uh, shine at night or at dark. Okay. And the last point, at night time, it is light, dark, or sunny. Oh, at night, is it light? No, it's light at morning. At uh, night time, is it dark? Yes. At night time, it's a dark. Is it sunny? No, it's a sunny at the morning. So, at night time, it's dark. Okay. Question number two, but true or false? Don't forget to read the question well. Read the question well. Focus about everything, then you can answer. Okay. Number one, the sun is bigger than the earth. Yes, sun is bigger than the earth. Number two, the sun is a planet. No, we said sun is a star. Number three, the sun gives us heat and light. Yes, we know that. Sun is a star that gives us heat and light. Okay, let's complete. The sun is a star. Yes, that gives us heat and light. Earth is a planet? True, we said it. Okay, people live on water? Of course not, we will die. So people live on land. Sea and rivers have water? Yes, and sea and river are the bigger area on Earth. The area of water on Earth is bigger than the area of land? Mm, which area is bigger? The area of water. So, it's a true. Number nine. We can see the stars at night time. Oh, do you remember? We said at the night time, we can see moon and the stars. What about the daytime? At the daytime, we can see sun and the clouds. I know sun is a star, but we can see only one star at the daytime and the cold sun. So, if I ask you, so you can see stars at the daytime? No, we can see only one star and the cold sun. So, at the daytime, we see the stars and the moon. Okay, so we can see the stars at night time? Yes, we can see stars and moon. The sun is a star? We said yes. The sun gives us heat only? Of course not, heat and light. At night time, we can see the sun? No, at night time, we can see moon and the stars. The sun gives us light at the daytime? Yes, of course. Okay, let's complete number 14. Okay, we can't see stars in the morning? We can't? Yes, we can't. Because I said we can see only one star and it's a cold sun. So can see, you can see many stars at the daytime? No. So it's true. After that match, which photos night? And you know this question well. Night time, we can see moon and the stars. After that, we can see water. In which photo? In this photo. We can see the sun. This photo of sun. Day. At the day, we can see sun and the clouds. So this photo is a day. Earth, this is our planet Earth. Okay. After that grade one, we will revise our body part. And don't forget to take the words from the keywords. Don't take, don't write any word. Take the words from the keywords like this. We have ear, head, eye, mouth, nose. Read the keywords first. Okay, if you write here, hair. Is it right? No, it will be wrong. Because you don't have hair in the keywords. We have head. So this part will be what? Head. And make a line on head. After that, what is this? It's an eye. It's our eye. We have two eyes in our face. After that, we have 
one nose. So make a line and draw it. Nose. And this is our ear. We have two ear. So right ear. And the last one we have one mouse. Okay. So we said answer the question of our body part from the keywords and let's revise it. Okay. In our face we have hair. After that we have two eyes, two ears, one nose and one mouth. Okay, after that it's our neck. After that my arm and my arm here is called elbow. It's called elbow. Hand and fingers. After that I have two legs and knee. Okay, that's it. Okay, we will now we will revise our five senses and we said our body parts help us to use our senses. What is our five senses? The first one, eye. I can use my eye to see. So the name of the sense called sight. The name of the sense called sight. Okay, after that I have two ears. My ears help us to hear. So the name of the sense called hearing. And I have a tongue. My tongue help me to taste the food. So the name of the sense called taste. And I have a skin. Skin cover all my body. My skin help me to feel or to touch. So the sense called feel or touch. Okay. And I have one nose. My nose help me to smell. So the name of the sense is the smell. So what is our five senses first? We have five senses. Don't forget it. Five senses. Sight, smell, taste, hear, and touch or feel. Okay, number one. I use space to see. Oh, I can see with my eyes. So I will write eyes. I use my space to smell. I can smell with my nose. So make a line and write nose. A space or used to hear sounds. I can hear sound with my ears. So write ears. My space can touch things. Of course, my hands because my hands covered with the skin and our skin help us to feel. And I use my space to taste, of course, my tongue. Okay, grade one. Again, grade one. Five, our five senses. When I see a bird, look, when I see, when I see, I use the sense of sight. So make a line and write sight. Number two, when I play with my dog, play with my dog, of course, I will touch my dog. So the name of the sense is touch. Number three, when I feel my mom's perfume, mm, I can smell my mom's perfume. So the sense called smell. Number four, when I enjoy the music. Oh, how can we enjoy the music? We hear it. So the name of the sense is hearing. And the last one, when I eat, of course I eat, so I use the sense of taste. Ok, 
okay and now let's revise the four season it's our last topic we have also keywords we said we can see many snow and many rain and the weather is very very cold in which season if in winter season in winter season we wear heavy jacket because it's very cold we wear our boots the second photo it's in spring because we see many beautiful flowers in the spring so if i see flowers so this means we are in spring season spring we go to the sea and go to the pool and wear t-shirts and short and the weather is very very hot in which season of course in summer season and the last one we see many leaves fall down from the trees in which season in autumn season and we said in autumn season the weather is very windy so this photo in autumn don't forget in a silent and that's it grid one i wish you good luck uh, goodbye